Would you trade your old Irish team jersey for a brand new one, even if it had your name on the back? I'm here with Sean St. Ledger, Irish international player, who is launching a trade in your old jersey scheme. Yeah, the free trading scheme. Right, so basically I would get rid of my old jersey. Yeah. The one that I've loved and saved up for. and Take it to Champion Sports. Right. <laughs> get 20 euros off. Okay. And then you get a brand new shirt. Right. And as a kid, I always loved getting a brand new shirt. I was an Aston Villa fan. Yeah. And so whenever my mum and dad got me one, I was, it was an absolute boss. But then, obviously, the good thing, you know, you, um, the old shirts are, are going to a chari charity we call Friends yeah. in Ireland, which is obviously based in South Africa. You know, they look after kids who are orphans. Uh, affected by AIDS and I'm fortunate enough you know I'm an ambassador and hopefully I'm going to deliver the shirts in the summer. Brilliant. Yeah, so, so we'll have loads of South African kids wearing Irish jerseys <laughs> yeah, going around the place. Hopefully you know it gets real cold you know uh, yeah. their winter obviously in our summer or what they call our summer so um, so you know it's not really a fashion thing it's a thing to to make sure they, they keep nice and warm. Yeah. So I'm obviously watching that you know I'm an ambassador for it's an absolute privilege and I'm I'm lucky that um, I'm part of it really, you know, I never would have thought it all the years ago when I was playing for Peterborough and to be here now, obviously playing for my country, and it's obviously a dream come true. Yeah, uh, you were playing last night, how did that go? Yeah, good, yeah. yeah. We obviously won, got through to the next round. Brilliant, congratulations. Yeah. And then you have the match coming up next week. Big one. You nervous? In, uh, uh, probably will be a little bit on a Friday night, you know, whenever the qualifiers come up right. and the stadiums is full. Um, it's. It's an unbelievable sight, you know, the atmosphere. And hopefully everyone have their, their new jerseys. I think we'll, we'll go green with pride, you know. So. Would you have come over to Ireland when you were a kid? Yeah, I did Dublin. Okay. You know, I went over to Your granddad's from Carlow? Yeah, my granddad. Oh, your granddad, well, alright. He was. He was. Okay. Yeah. Right. Because uh, I'm from there myself, so oh, I would really? be fairly yeah. familiar. Yeah, yeah, just then. Just my mum's been over loads recently. Oh, yeah. really? Yeah, yeah, she's oh, been over loads. Cool. And obviously, the family send over all paper clippings yep. back over to my to my mum and my dad of what I've been doing in, in the papers and oh, things right. like that. So it's it's great, you know, to see family and, and when the games are, are on, you know, they all they all really really look forward to it. Cool. And are you what do, what do you do when you're not like I mean the standard question that I get <laughs> asked to ask soccer players is do you play yourself in FIFA? <laughs> my little brother does. So, <laughs> yeah. nice. I used to. I went through a phase, you know, when the PlayStation 3 came out straight away. I nice. played a football manager and that kind of thing I would do. But as I've got older, I've, I've not really. I've, I've kind of gone more into girly things like shopping. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. Oh, dear. Oh, God. Oh, God. <laughs> and um, is your training schedule hectic at the moment? Um, yeah, pretty much, really. You know, in the Championship, there's always loads and loads of games, like the Saturday, Tuesdays. Right. So it usually means that you're done on a Sunday can be another Wednesday because it's a game Saturday um, and obviously there's been games here you know with a friendly so I flew over here and then I've been looking for a, a place but I've not really had the time because right. obviously I've been here right. and I've been in Leicester, I've been in Bayern, I've been at away games okay. so it's been pretty hectic but well, I'm looking forward to it you know it's some of like I say I've always dreamed of, of being he's a, he's a footballer so uh, I'm living out a dream. And then playing for Ireland obviously a big honour but tell me yeah. I, I understand playing for a team, you, you all see each other loads and, yeah. and, and there's a big amount of team camaraderie, whereas with the yeah. Irish players, you're kind of coming together for the yeah. training and then the matches and stuff like that. Do you keep in touch with any of them outside of that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think obviously Black, Black Pretty Messenger's obviously helped iPhones, you know, with, right. with the WhatsApp you know, technology good. these days, it's frightening. So yeah, everyone keeps in touch, um, but you know, it's great when everyone comes, comes back together, because obviously you might not have seen as them people for I don't know a couple of weeks so yeah. there's always new stories to tell or so for a bit you can't stop talking kind of thing you know it's, um, it is great and obviously the same I think core and base of the squad's been there for quite a long quite a few squads now you know so I think there's a real togetherness and do you think there's a chance do you, that, do you, the, do you think that you're in with a chance without that you know I think everyone's got a real belief you know Friday night it's, Coming out here playing against the back here, we we got a good result out there. I think yeah. you know, a draw, but hopefully we get the three points here. Then we go to Moscow, fully, fully confident of trying to turn them over because I think we've got points proved. We didn't do our best when we played against Russia um, here, so this time around you know, we're hopefully trying to do it. But first and foremost is the Slovakia game. It's a big one, you know. Yeah. You're always trying to win your home games.
Brilliant. So let's remind people, bring in your old Ireland jersey, Yeah. two champion sports, yep. get 20 quid, yep. get the new jersey, and then uh, get 20 quid off the new jersey even, and then your jersey goes to South Africa for a charity out there. Exactly. I even think you get 10, 10 euros off a, a free phone as well, I think. So. Oh, nice. Oh, yeah, it's because it's three mobile. Everyone's a winner. Everyone's <laughs> a winner. John, thanks very much. <laughs> Cheers. No worries, thank you.